Okay, in this video I'm going to demonstrate how to create a sketch using a image found from the internet. So the first step in this case is you go up to create your sketch. So you click create sketch and then start a sketch by clicking on your work plane. The next step is to go up here to where it says insert. So then you click on image right here and then it'll open up a dialog box. And then what you do is you navigate to the folder where you have your photo saved, which in my case is going to be in the pictures folder. Then you scroll down until you find the photo and double click on it. And then it will come up here where you'll see the outline of how big your picture is. So what you can do is just then place that right in your drawing. And right here you just click right on OK through that and there's your photo. So here I have my Tyrannosaurus Rex. So the next step in this process is to go use your spline tool which is right up here in the draw toolbox. So you click on spline and what you're going to want to do is pick a starting point and you're going to want to zoom in on it and then click. And you keep just follow right around the outline of your photo. When you get to curves you might have to click a, a few more times to keep the proper arc and just keep clicking right around the surface following the outline of your shape like so. So you just keep moving right around your shape Alright, once you get so far around your drawing here, you'll notice that my picture here has legs. At this point in time, I'm not going to trace those legs, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to continue my spline just going straight around the leg. I'm going to go through it and just keep drawing the contour of the body itself because I'm going to have this be made into a couple different pieces and again right here I'm just going to go right on through as if the leg wasn't even on the drawing here so just keep working my way right up along the body of the Tyrannosaurus Rex so I'm going to act like these external features aren't even here and just keep going once more when you get up around curves, you're going to have to click multiple times to keep the radius the proper way. So right here around these curves, I'm just going to keep clicking and place multiple points in there. So again, right here, I'm going to click a few times just to get the, the curve around the mouth there properly. And just keep moving on. And when you reach the end, you'll see, make sure that you get that little green dot there at the end. So then you click, and right click, and create. And you'll notice that I now have a green outline here. So what you can do is right click, OK, and click on your picture that you inserted here, and just delete it. And you'll see that the outline remains right where you drew it with the spline tool. So then you can finish your sketch. At this point, you know how to continue. You can just go on extrude your part to the thickness it should be which should be about 1.125 inches and then right there you go here we have our completed outline of the Tyrannosaurus Rex so there you go